एवरीवन आई होप यू ऑल आर वेल एंड योर प्रिपरेशन फॉर अपकमिंग टीसीएस एंड क्यूटी इज गोइंग वेरी गुड सो बेस्ट विशेष फ्रॉम माय साइड मेक श्योर यू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल स्टडी विद सौम्या बिफोर प्रोसीडिंग फर्दर इन द वीडियो इट्स अ हम्बल रिक्वेस्ट फ्रॉम माय साइड एंड आई एम श्योर दैट दिस चैनल इज डेफिनेटली गोइंग टू बी वेरी वेरी हेल्पफुल फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू सो डू सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल डू शेयर दिस चैनल विथ योर फ्रेंड्स एज वेल एंड आज टेम टू सब्सक्राइब द चैनल राइट सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द टिप्स दैट आर गोइंग टू बी वेरी वेरी हेल्पफुल फॉर यू to ease your aptitude in the tcs and qt so i will discuss that what are the important topics that you must go through because now it's the time very less days are remaining so in these days which topics you can cover even if you have not started because maybe a case that some of you have not started yet so i will tell you the important topics and important formulas that you should be aware of and the topics that are very very important and there are very high chances that you will expect most of the questions from these topics only so make sure to watch the complete video do subscribe this channel let's start with the video now so after doing the proper analysis of the questions of the aptitude questions that are being asked in um october and qt exam or in february and qt exam or in previous year exams as well what we have analyzed so we have came to know certain topics that are very very important and you should not leave them because mostly the questions are being asked from these topics only so as a few days are remaining so it's my personal advice that you can go through these important topics so what i will do i will start from the easy one topic first and this is how we will go to the advanced level right so make sure to watch the complete video so the first one is simplification right so mostly in the tcs you will get around 6 to or like 5 to 6 question from simplification only and here for this particular topic you don't have to revise any formula any trick anything nothing is needed then what is needed just a simple bod mass rule that's it just a simple bod mass rule and some sort of calculation so if calculation is your game you are good at calculation simplification is all yours and for sure they are not going to ask you po level simplification right it is going to be simple only just make sure that you are not in hurry because what happens sometime even easy question we do wrong so don't be in hurry just stop advice that don't be in hurry just stay calm and slowly slowly do all the questions even not that slowly because time matters in aptitude time matters a lot and most of the time you students miss the questions because of time because time is up or they are not able to balance the time and speed together so you have to make sure that time and speed both are balanced when you are solving aptitude questions because time is limited around 1 minute or 1 and 1/2 minute they are going to give you to solve a particular question so make sure to balance the time this is the first question that like first topic that is very very important that you should go through solve some questions revise the questions see how good you good you are at calculation and if you want me to recommend any particular website then uh, i would say india mix right because here you won't get that difficult question even that not that easy as well so like moderate to easy will be there right moderate to easy will be there along with that you will get mock test and certain other things to test yourself so you can go with that also there are certain other websites um better than this one so it depends on you whether like which one is suiting you so you can go with either india mix or any other one but make sure to give mock it is very very important to analyze yourself to check how good you are um, are you able to balance time and speed both or you are not so this is the time this is the last time so even you can attend mock also you will get lots of mock regarding aptitude reasoning and other sections as well um, online so make sure to give the mock right next topic from which you you will definitely get the questions most of the questions is algebra even in october exam also in february exam also students told that mostly questions were from algebra for algebra part what you have to do revise all the identities and we are learning these identities from childhood right 
so that is the only thing that you have to do just revise all the identities solve some questions based on these identities only so that you can aware of the pattern right so solve some questions and revise the identities this is what you can do next topic is ages very simple topic very very simple topic if you are aware of the things and also in not only in tcs mostly exam you will get question from ages only right so that's what the thing that you can go through ages as well if like more this is with their very rare chance that you will miss out the question based on ages so revise the question based on ages next is profit and loss very important topic very very important topic so for this first you have to revise the formulas that is what is the formula for discount profit percent loss percent profit loss so these sort of like simple simple formulas that you should be aware of right so relation between market price and selling price just these is if you are clear with this small small concepts now you are definitely not going to make the question based on profit and loss wrong right so what you can do after covering this and come in this sequence only and i'm not saying that everyone should come but if you haven't started aptitude yet like you are having some basic knowledge then you can start like very few days are remaining so you can start in this sequence right then come to profit and loss so like uh, what personally i do that uh, first i cover percentage then come to profit and loss but don't worry they won't ask you that difficult uh, fraction part and all things so no need to worry just go through the profit and loss part so for this you have to be aware of basic simple formulas only and just by using the same you will be able to solve the question so that is the thing i don't know why most of the uh, students are afraid of this profit and loss and si and ci so suppose si and ci is your weakness simple interest and compound interest is your weakness so what you have to do it is the last time don't touch this topic don't touch because for sure you cannot revise the things now and maybe a case that just go through simple formulas because maybe a case that some question you are getting that in which we you have to directly implement the formula for example they are asking you simple interest and they have given uh, this principal amount they have given rate they have given time and this 100 this is a simple formula that you have to implement so i'm not saying that don't go with the formulas formulas you have to remember right so si formula ci formula maybe it is that they have provided all the values and simply you have to implement the formula and question will be solved so just go through the formula part but don't touch any new concept any new technique or any new concept in si and ci if you are not good at this it's okay if you are not able to solve two to three questions just randomly mark any one because this time there is no negative mark Hear it, guys. Listen it carefully. That there is no negative marking in TCS and QT. So if you are having any doubt regarding negative marking, so there is no negative marking. After profit and loss, which topic you should go with? Statistics. Yes. So mainly questions were from statistics also in October, in February as well. So for this question were not that difficult. So no need to worry. Like they can ask you a question. They have provided. mean mode mean mode they have provided and now they are asking median so you should be aware of that what is the relation between this mean median and mode some basic formulas in median and that's it you will be able to solve they can ask you mean or uh, on the basis of some observation they can ask you median right so just be aware how to calculate these uh, values that is mean median and what is the relationship between mean median and mode right so that is the thing next what you can cover is next what you can cover is si and ci you can go with i'm not saying that you have to leave any topic this is i'm um, telling if you have not started or like if you want a proper plan that which topics are mandatory and which topics i should go first and to make to ace my aptitude part so that is what i am sharing here i am not saying that you have to leave si and ci or anything 
obviously like try your best try to solve try to prepare as much as possible but as if you are asking me to tell the important topics so accordingly i am telling the things right so that is the thing data interpretation they can ask they will definitely ask right so data interpretation question are not going to be that difficult so no need to worry some simple data will be provided and just by observing the data you will be able to calculate the answer so data interpretation is also very important so for data interpretation just solve uh, i should say seven to eight simple questions not that difficult they are going to ask so no need to worry i am saying many times that the, the paper is going to be moderate to easy level only some question may be that some question may be two to three question may be that they are difficult but remaining questions are going to be moderate to easy level only so no need to worry uh, regarding aptitude part the thing is that uh, like mainly students told that they know the answer they know the concept everything is fine but where they lag behind in time so take care of the thing that if you are just don't give more than two minutes to any question if you are not able to solve it out move to the next question right uh, like move to the next question immediately don't waste your time randomly mark to any option and just move to the next question because time matters a lot during competitive exam right so these are the important topics that you can go through in the last time and just there's no shortcut for aptitude only thing is that practice practice and only practice as much as you practice you will be master of aptitude so keep practicing keep learning i hope this video has helped you so do like this video do share this video do subscribe my channel bye bye